In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use Google Docs to create a book recommendation form that you can send out to your patrons, embed in a website, or have as a hyperlink on your website. First, you want to make sure that you're signed into your Gmail account. You'll notice up here on the top right beside your name, there are a series of squares. And if you click on this, this opens up the apps, and you see one for Drive. And when you do this, this pulls up your Google Drive where you can start creating um, Google Docs. Click on the red Create button and then click on Form. Okay, and let's give this a title Book Recommendation. And for the template, I'm going to use this sample form here that says Books Classic. Press OK. All right, now we can get started with the questions. Well, the first question is obviously the title. And we want to make this a text question. We don't want that to be multiple choice. And we want this to be a required question. I'll press Done. Let's press Add an Item. And the next one will be Author. And notice it's automatically selected text so that, since that was our last selection. Again, I'm going to make this a required question and done. And then I'm going to add a publication date. But I'm not going to make it required. I will press done. And finally, I'm going to add ISBN number. And I'm not going to make that required either. So you see here we have the basic fields for a book recommendation form. If you want to see what it looks like live, click on view the live form. and This shows you what your patrons are going to see. Now if you are content with it and you're ready to send it out to people, you can click on file and you can click on send form and you can either take this link here and you can embed it on your website maybe you want to make a link that just says book recommendation form you can also send it out via Google Plus Facebook or Twitter you can also click on this button to embed and it'll give you the embed code here and you can change the size of the document so that you could embed uh, this form on another website so how do you get the responses uh, you'll notice here there is a tab that says view responses and what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill out the form and I'm just going to do this for the sake of showing you how it works so I'm going to type in a book I'm going to press submit. Okay. I'm going to go back to the form and I see the responses here. All right. And below it, you see view responses. And what it does, it actually saves all the responses in an Excel spreadsheet. Okay. So it could save several hundred responses. When you're ready to download this, if you don't want it online, um, by the way, other people would not be able to see this form here, just you and other people that you've allowed to use your account. You can go to File, Download As, and Microsoft Excel if you want to save it as an Excel spreadsheet. Okay. Going back to the Google Drive there. Uh, you will see that now you have the form here so you can always go back to the form and you can make edits if necessary and you'll also see the online spreadsheet with all the uh, responses so I hope this helps you in using Google Docs to create a book recommendation form for your library thanks for watching